Hi everyone and welcome to your channeled love message from your Divine Masculine. This is going to be a general reading guys so please just keep that in mind. If you are after personalized tarot reading with myself please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here in the show more section below. So I'll also be using the Angel Answers Oracle cards as well. I'll give the cards a shuffle and see what is the message here from Divine Masculine that is trying to reach you. So what is it that they want you to know or what is it they want to communicate with you and they want you to understand here? What is it that they need you to know? that are just sort of flying out okay um Your Divine Masculine here has some very strong feelings for you, okay? They have some um, very strong romantic feelings here with the appearance of the Lover's card here. Um, your Divine Masculine feels as though the two of you here have been uh, destined to cross paths and you are destined to be together. Now, your Divine Masculine here is weighed down with this energy here of exhaustion, they want you to know that they're tired of fighting this battle here. They can't win, okay? This is someone who has some very strong feelings um, that they can't give up for you here. This is someone who misses you. They want to know that they are yours and yours forever. This is someone who has some unshakable um, feelings for you. Someone who feels that they're in love with you. Someone who feels that they could spend the rest of their life here with you. They I feel like there's a question here on their mind. They want you to know if, um, if you miss them the way that they miss you here. Okay, now, they're thinking about you a lot. Just because your Divine Masculine hasn't necessarily communicated with you, it doesn't mean that you're not on their mind. There is something here that holds them back from communicating what they truly feel. Maybe they're scared they're going to be met with rejection. Maybe they're scared that, you know, the timing is not right. The timing is inappropriate here. Your Divine Masculine has dreams about you. And they have, they definitely have visions about you. And they have a long-term vision here. Um... They want to share the future with you here. They also want... Notice this whole... How they're taking their time with something. They don't want you to pressure them. Is the message that we're getting here. They definitely... Um, they remember the day that the two of you first met here. Almost like it was yesterday here. And they've been thinking about you ever since. Now, um, I feel like there's also this energy of them wanting to apologize. Um, they want to apologize here that they're not always, they don't always put their best foot forward here. Or they've made some mistakes here. In the past, notice the, you know, the three here, the three of cups, um, a bit of a triangle here. Notice how the Three of Swords here um, hover above the figure's head here. Okay, they've made some mistakes they regret, but they're only human. They've definitely made some mistakes that have weighed this, um, that are weighing the energy down. So they're not communicating with you right now because they need to sort some things out first before they can come to you. Okay, so, but they have this, for some reason, for some reason, they don't want you to pressure them and they don't feel the pressure purely because they know that you're theirs. Okay? They know that you're theirs or they know that eventually the two of you are going to, you know, meet up, uh, end up together here. Now, 
Now, they have your divine masculine he has buried. Um, they have, you have actually, you have um, opened up some deep buried um, feelings inside of them. Okay. They need to find a way to liberate those feelings here. And the only way to do that is by loving you, is by actually, you know, pursuing this connection with you here. Your Divine Masculine is seeking freedom and liberation here. They're uh, longing for peace and bliss. They're currently sort of processing all of these uh, feelings here. There are lessons, okay? I feel like they're slowly learning their lessons. If the two of you are currently separated, they want to communicate to you that they are learning some lessons slowly, gradually, but they're learning some lessons here. They also understand that their karma here is reflecting back their mistakes here. Um, their mistakes which might have been ignorant, which might have been selfish here. Okay. Um, they want to communicate to you that they've definitely been struck by Cupid's arrow here. Your Divine Masculine is um, is in love with you, um, or is falling in love with you, or is mad, um, you know, is madly in love with you, head over heels in love with you. They're definitely struck by the intoxicating arrow of Cupid here. They feel your love and they feel your light here. Okay, Something paralyzes your DM here, um, Divine Masculine, from actually truly opening up. They feel these feelings, but I feel like before they come to you and before they actually allow for these feelings to really blossom, they first have to understand and process this. Okay, they're scared. They're scared maybe if they come towards you, they may be turned away. Though deep inside they feel that the two of you are meant to be together and will end up together, they're still human and they're still flawed. You have to understand that. You have to be a little bit more forgiving here. They understand that there are ties that connect the two of you together here. Your Divine Masculine right now is being... They're being put in a position here, okay? They're moving through time and through space here. And they're being asked to ask forgiveness here of you. They, they, want, to forgive, they want you to forgive them of their past mistakes here. Their past mis mistakes which you might have looked at and you know thought that they were ignorant um, or they were self you know selfish here they're being temporarily pulled away from you here but it's not for nothing okay there's a lesson for them to learn and they say that absence makes the heart grow fonder so your divine masculine although not necessarily with you right now their feelings for you are definitely deepening and strengthening here currently their position Currently, the energy feels as though they're contemplating how to come forward. They're contemplating how to reach out. And I don't mean just, okay, they, they want to reach out and communicate um, with you or how they're going to do that. By actually coming forward with this sense of openness, with this sense of transparency, um, they, this sense of nakedness here with the lover's card. They, um, they're currently contemplating. That's what's on their mind, okay? So it's not just about, okay, I'm going to send... A text message and I'm going to connect with you it's not just about that it's how do they really connect with you okay on an emotional level here they're, they're being faced with the mirror here the mirror of karma is what I'm seeing and right now they're recounting their past actions here because your divine masculine might have not not have chosen you here. I feel like somehow for a lot of you there's a strong indication of a third party situation. So there may be a connecting energy around the divine masculine. And although they may be in a relationship or they may be committed to someone else, your divine masculine wishes they were with you. Because they know you're that twin flame connection, okay? Um, they want to stoke the flames here with you. And they understand that everything here happens in divine order, which is why they sort of don't want to pressure this or why they feel like they want to hold on to um, this feeling a little bit longer and try to process and, you know, try to um, internalize this feeling a little bit longer here. 
because they understand that things will unfold in divine orchestration and divine order. If it's meant to be, um, there's nothing here that can get in the way. And they understand that, you know, these feelings here, because they're so real and raw, that they're only going to intensify from here. Many things are shifting for your Divine Masculine right now, and for you as well. And a twin flame connection is actually a reflection of the soul here. So right now, your Divine Masculine is mirroring here your feelings is mirroring the intensity of your emotions and is mirroring the intensity of the situation in which the two of you find yourself entangled in okay they want you to see the true mirror of them here they're inspired by you here they're inspired by the strength and the love you've shown to them they inspired by, you know, the, the preciousness of your memory here. Although there's a, a pain and exhaustion around your Divine Masculine's energy here, there's also a lot of empowerment and inspiration that you give to them, okay? They're tr there's, th your Divine Masculine here is drowning in a sea of emotions, okay? But I feel like it's your strength and it's your love here. And it's your energy here that keeps them, that keeps giving them the inner strength to sort of fight the currents of their emotions here. And these are some very powerful um, messages from your Divine Masculine. I'm just going to go ahead just to um, close the reading and tie up, um, sorry, and uh, pull out a few angel answers to tie into the reading here. Okay, within the next few months so your divine masculine here i feel like is preparing themselves to reach out and connect with you okay start your journey within the next few months so it's very likely that you will um they, you will hear uh from your divine masculine there will be communication or there will be progression there will be a movement a shift of some sort the answer is a resounding yes yes they still think about you and they want to know whether you think about them too Yes, they still love you. They're, yes, they still feel me, even the two of you are far apart. Yes, they believe that this is going to um, this is going to manifest, and they believe that the love that the two of you share um, and the energies that you know exist between the two of you here can only intensify and can only grow more stronger and more powerful. And yes, they believe that. The love that they feel for you is the love that you feel for them. They do believe in a twin flame connection. They do believe, even if they don't want to label it that, even if they don't want to put a title to that, they believe in what they feel for you. They believe in the love the two of you share. They believe that the two of you are destined together and that no matter what life throws at you, no matter the, um, the setbacks, the obstacles, the circumstances, they believe that the two of you have what it takes to fight this battle, okay, and win. They feel very empowered to come back home to you, is the message I want to leave it at. Okay, guys, and these are your messages. I just want to thank, thank you all for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to this channel, liking, sharing, or commenting. Um, stay tuned for Divine Masculine messages um, tomorrow, and feel free to check out my weekly love content. Thank you guys again for your time and attention. Bye for now.